Hello, good afternoon everybody. It's Hasnain Nawaz from Pharma Technologies. Uh, I'm a product manager uh, here for uh, Enable Technologies, which includes the drive-through solution and also the digital solution of Pharma Technologies. So our today's webinar is regarding healthcare drive-through. So just to give you a brief about uh, drive-through that what exactly is drive-through and how uh, it came into the uh, healthcare sector. So uh, previously, the drive-through was only been used in uh, QSR chains and the restaurants along with coffee shops. But with the advent of uh, technology, people use, people use and people love to have a drive-through in uh, their everyday uh, business. If, you, if I take example of any retail shop, now the retail shops are also going with drive-throughs for delivering their items to their respective customers. And when it comes to the healthcare, uh, now most of the customers along with healthcare departments also want drive-through through which they can cater their customers. Uh, what are the examples and who are using it and what exactly is the function of drive-through technology in healthcare. Let's proceed uh, to that. So our today's webinar will be composed of four different sections. In the first section, we will talk about the pharmacy drive-through solution, that how the pharmacies are utilizing drive-through and they are leveraging technology uh, to provide services to their customers. Then we will talk about uh, the audio system in the drive-through. So what exactly is technology doing in the drive-through section of any pharmacy? In the third section, we talk about the drive-through concept in healthcare departments. With the advent of uh, novel COVID-19, we are seeing a lot of healthcare departments using drive-through for their screening center or uh, attending their patients or the visitors. And then at the end, we'll talk about our case study, which we have done for uh, one of government projects in UAE. So we'll talk about that as well. So uh, if we talk about the pharmacy drive-through, then we have two different uh, sections in this. The first is the drive-through kiosk in uh, pharmacy so when i talk about the chaos it means that if you have a drive through lane if you have a drive through lane for your uh, customers the car will come and the car will stand in front of this chaos now this chaos is composed of three different sections the first section is the video communication with the pharmacist inside so the camera is installed on this chaos and the camera is installed on the inside of the pharmacy as well. So the pharmacist can speak and at the same time can see the customer or the patient or the visitor uh, on this 19 inches screen. Then on the left side and the right side we have on, on the right side we have the prescription scanner. So if you have a prescription with you, you will bring the prescription and you will put the prescription in the prescription box. So what will happen the, the pharmacist inside the store? He has the scanner, so he will scan your uh, prescription and he will he will talk to you that, okay, this item which we have, this is the item which we don't have, and then he will prepare your items uh, before you proceed to the service window. And on the left side, you have the intercom or the telephone set as well. So the chaos, composed of, chaos is composed of mic and speaker, so you can communicate loudly with your uh, pharmacist inside the store and if you want to talk something personal to this pharmacist then you have the capability of uh, telephone set or intercom so you can pick up the intercom and you can talk to the pharmacist in private via that telephone set so this is the basic uh, infrastructure of pharmacy kiosk so what we discussed we discussed three items one the audio and video communication between the pharmacist and the customer. Second, the prescription, uh, which patient or the customer will bring and he will place the prescription and the inside pharmacist can read the prescription. And the third part is the intercom or the telephone set through which you can talk to your 
uh, customer or you can talk to your pharmacist in private so this is the pharmacy chaos which you will gonna have when you visit any drive through in pharmacy now on, on this screen you can see that on the order point you have the pharmacy kiosk you, you can see on the order point we have the pharmacy kiosk and alongside it we have the digital signage as well so on the digital signage what you can do you can run the promotions you can run the items you can run each and everything which you want and it is connected to the cloud so from the cloud what you can do you can run your promotions or your any items on this digital screen so once the once the order has been placed on the order point now it's time to go to the collection point so once you receive the collection point till that time the pharmacist has prepared all your items which you uh, requested from him through the drive through chaos pharmacy drive through chaos now he will take the payment terminal he'll he'll take the cash or the payment from you through this pen machine and he will deliver the item to you and you can exit the drive through lane from the next section so see how we have avoided your parking of the car and you get out of the car you go inside the pharmacy you order something and then you take that order and then you come back again out of the pharmacy you sit in your car so we have avoided all that journey through pharmacy drive through so you you are sitting in your car you are coming on the order point you are talking to pharmacist you are placing your order and on the collection point when you're reaching you are taking your order you are doing the collection and you leave so for example if we if we need one or two items from the pharmacy uh, it's a very hectic job to park the car and go inside the pharmacy <coughs> excuse me so for the one two items you don't have to get out of the car you can use the pharmacy drive through and get your order uh, ready and if you have a lot of other items as well then you can also use the pharmacy kiosk for example in the heat time or in the very in, in in the summer or in the rainy time you cannot get out of the car so drive through is very very suitable for the pharmacies as well and we have the case studies installed in ksa market in more than uh, 15 pharmacies so the name of the pharmacies are very really, uh, popular in this market so yes the pharmacy drive through is a successful venture and we are the only company we are the only organization doing pharmacy drive through solution in ksa market specifically so moving on to the uh, one component one component of the uh, drive through solution for pharmacies now when we talk about the uh, drive through solution for any of the coffee shop or restaurant or the pharmacy, we need to keep into consideration that the audio communication, the audio communication between customer and the pharmacist is accurate. So this is the main challenge which we have gotten when we have studied the drive through market in any of the vertical. So the most issue what we were facing are, were the audio communication that customer cannot hear pharmacist properly or the pharmacist cannot hear customer properly so we have come up with the solution which is being used by more than 85 percent of the drive through market and that is the audio system which is eos hd solution so eos means the evolution of sound and hd is hd so we are using hd audio system now what exactly is hd audio system in the traditional market, we were having different audio systems from different com competitors. So we have collected that data and we have collected all that information. And then we have compared our, our drive-through communication system with all those solutions. So we come across two different, uh, we come across two different outputs. One is that there is always a noise in the background when customer is speaking outside. And there is always a noise inside the store where pharmacist is sitting. So we have two different type of noises. So with our audio system, we have 44% improvement of the sound on the outside. Like for example, if we have a pharmacy on uh, 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 near to very near to the main road, so you can hear a lot of background noise of 
cars, of buses, of traffic, of horns. So all audio system, it does the noise reduction and noise cancellation in that regard. So 44% improvement with the previous or different competitors of drive through uh, with this audio system and when we talk about the indoor noise which is the noise of collecting the order noise of payment terminals noise noise of acs noise of different noises for example if the pharmacist is taking order from customer through headset then there are a lot of background noise which is going on so that noise has been reduced by 88 percent with our drive through system drive through audio system so in, in, in very short term, uh, wh what I want to explain you is that the drive-through audio system which we are providing in this market and the different markets in Middle East, it is being used by 85% of all drive-through um, drive market shares. So this is the basic and the very important benefit of our drive-through audio system. And then we have different optional systems in our drive-through audio system, uh, which includes the greetings or reminders or alerts, or then you can optionally you can optionally uh, add uh, the the audio call through our headset. And then at the same time, our base station in the audio system it has the capability of having sensors which can provide you alerts on deep freezers or fryers temperature as well. Okay, so that's it from the pharmacy uh, drive-through solution. Now, let's move on to the healthcare drive-through. Now, the healthcare drive before I explain you the healthcare drive-through, I just want to make sure that you understand the pharmacy drive-through very well. Because healthcare drive-through is almost same as the pharmacy drive-through, like the concept is almost similar. In, in the drive in the in the pharmacy drive-through, what you are having, you're having the a pharmacy drive through kiosk but in our healthcare drive through we have the profiling stop what does it mean the profiling stop so profiling stop mean that you bring your car you stood in front of the kiosk and you did your profiling like your id your mobile number your qr so it will get your all the details your mobile number and your comma number or your id card uh, number it will get complete details of you it will record the details and it will send you to the next section for the sample collection. So on the sample collection point, we have one pharmacist or one uh, healthcare official or you have the technician uh, there who will take your sample and he will collect your sample, keep your sample in uh, testing and he will ask you to leave the drive through lane and you will receive your uh, report by in 24 hours or within 48 hours so <clears throat> this is how the healthcare drive through will work now the concept from this uh, presentation or the, this slide is not clear so what we will do we will go directly to the case study and i'll explain you that how this profiling and the sample collection has been done Okay, this is the case study which we have done in Abu Dhabi Healthcare Services for drive through part. Now, this was the initiative taken by Abu Dhabi government and uh, what they have done, they have created the screening centers for the patients or the visitors to come. So they have created uh, more, than five, uh, more than five screening centers in which they have, in, they have placed different four or six drive-through lanes so it's a big tent where they are installing four or six drive-through lanes where car can come car can stand and car cars can stand in front of the chaos and then the, does the screening now what is the basic purpose of doing this screening center testing for uh, using drive-through now the main the main reason to do that is to reduce the time for screening of any patient. Normally, in now due to the COVID-19, COVID we have hospitals overstuffed, we have pharmacies overstuffed, we have uh, test training centers or the screening centers overstuffed. So with the remote screening center, the goal is to make sure that we complete the screening of people within three or five minutes. Within 
in three to five minutes, we what we do, we do the complete screening of any patient. So it reduces the time and it increases the number of patients which we need to operate or attend daily. Now, how this sorry, how this drive-through exactly works? Now you can see here the point number one, point number two, three, four, and five. Now the point number one is the drive-through lane. So the car all the cars come on this lane and stand in front of point two, which is our communication kiosk. Now, what this communication kiosk does, we'll explain it on the next slide. Now, let's move on to the third point. On the on the third point, what uh, on, 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 from the point number two, when the screen when the data collection has been done, then we move the car to the point number three, where we have this we where we have the person standing uh, who will be taking the samples of the visitors and on the point number four he'll take the uh, he'll take the samples he'll store the samples and then he'll do the complete testing with those samples and then from this he will generate the report and send the reports in 24 hours and on the fifth point fifth point is the exit of that drive-through lane so this is the complete journey of any healthcare drive-through for covid 19 testing or any other testing in future if required now let's talk about the communication kiosk. What exactly is this kiosk? So on the communication kiosk, we have three different items. <clears throat> when you reach any communication kiosk, there is a hand sanitizer. So first you have to do the hand sanitizing with that. On the second part, we have the ID card reader. So you will put your ID card, whether it's a comma or the <coughs> any other ID, you have to put it there and it will automatically be integrated with ministries in ministry of interior or ministry of communication so they'll extract all your data and on the left side you have the audio box so how what this audio box does it is it is the communication mode between the uh, between the healthcare official which is who is sitting inside the tent far away from this communication uh, chaos so the basic function or the basic uh, concept here is to make sure that we don't have any physical intervention when it comes to taking data or registering of a patient. So we don't have to do anything in that. The audio box is there. Through the audio box, customer or the visitor can speak to the healthcare official who is sitting inside the tent and he's wearing the headset. Now, after getting registered, through the communication kiosk, the car will move to the point number three, as we explained two slides before. Then the healthcare official is standing there. He will check the temperature of the uh, visiting uh, customer or the patient, and he will take the blood sample or the swab uh, sample. Swab sample. He'll do the collection of swab sample, and he'll store that swab collection on the screening or testing center, which you can see on the left bottom of your image the debt, the samples will be stored in this tent now once the samples have been uh, collected and the registration has been done the customer or the patient or the visitor will be asked to leave the drive through lane and you will get your report within 48 hours through your mobile phone which is registered to your national id so this is the complete infrastructure or the complete journey of drive-through for regarding healthcare. If we talk about the COVID-19 or the any other uh, pandemic which we might have in the near future or any other point of time or any other testing which we need to do or the vaccination, for example, the vaccination in the future will be very uh, uh, will be very feasible using this uh, healthcare drive-throughs. So this is the concept of drive-through. Now, on top of the healthcare drive-through solutions, we have the mobile clinics as well. So in mobile clinics also, we have the audio communication boxes uh, through which patients or the visitors can speak to the healthcare official uh, by using headsets without having, without having any, any physical intervention. So this is also really good in terms of uh, increase increase in the testing or uh, uh, for example in the far areas where people cannot come to the 
screening center for testing. We can send the mobile clinics to those areas, and it increases the productivity of healthcare uh, healthcare uh, testing capacity by eight to ten percent daily. So we operate or we do the testing through mobile clinics uh, by and it increases by ten percent uh, on, on on daily basis. So this is uh, regarding a drive-through solution and in terms of healthcare, which includes the pharmacy, the hospitals, and the screening centers. Uh, the screening center concept, which we have shown, it can be done on the uh, remote screening centers, which, as I showed you, that we have, we have those kind of screening centers. And at the same time, it can be installed in hospitals as well. So, for example, if hospitals have entrance, <coughs> any entrance, so you can install this kiosk or this uh, speaker post uh, on the entrance of any hospital and before allowing anyone to enter that uh, uh, hospital, you can collect their data and you can ask from them any information you can ask. For example, you want to say that, okay, you can, you can go back or you can come on the fast track line. So in the hospitals, this concept can be deployed. In the pharmacies, it's been it's already been deployed. So uh, if anyone have more pharmacies, definitely this concept can be applied. And as I said, in the remote screening centers, which are very hot at the moment, uh, this concept can be applied and help to the government or any other bodies who want to do the screening of people to make sure that they recover or they get themselves quarantined. Uh, this concept can be applied and leveraged. So that's it uh, from our our perspective. Now, if somebody have any questions regarding this drive-through, we can we can we are more than happy to answer. Hello, Krishnan. Uh, myself, uh, see, uh, I have one question uh, um, regarding this. Uh, Pharmacy drive-through. Yes. So in that one, uh, uh, any any duration. So between one customer to another customer, any duration of uh, one customer order from order point to uh, receiving the materials point, any duration is there? Yeah, this is very good question actually. That uh, and and this sums up the whole discussion about drive-through. That why people should use drive-through solution. So. When we talk about that, why should people use drive through solution, we should better come up with the data analytics. What kind of data analytics? That how much time the car is taking on the order point and how much time the car is taking on the order collection point and what is the total time for the complete journey in any pharmacy drive through Now, currently, uh, the concepts which we have deployed in KSA market the time to serve one customer is three minutes and 40 seconds. So for example, if I'm a customer, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to any pharmacy like Aldaba pharmacy or Mahdi pharmacy or any pharmacy drive through What I will do, I will stand on the collection point. I will order something. I will go to the, uh, I will go to the collection point and receive what I have ordered and leave the drive through it should not take me more than four minutes so this is where the importance of drive through comes in in the traditional way if you park the car in the parking you get out of the car you go to the store inside and then when you reach the counter you might have queue so you have to stand in the queue then pharmacist will take your order then he will make the order ready he will deliver the order to you you will get out of the pharmacy and then you will get into your car so this complete journey will take much more time than what time you are consuming on the drive through so i believe i have answered your question yes thank you Shneen. it's really very nice thank you yeah anyone uh, have any question please feel free to ask Okay, so uh, I think uh, that's it from my side. So if you have any query, this video will be uploaded to our YouTube account. So you can anytime uh, log into our YouTube account and we have our social media team working day and night to promote our solutions and to make sure that we provide help 
in terms of healthcare in the market. So thank you so much, everybody, for your time. We'll be in touch. Goodbye.